hey guys welcome back to my channel it has been a month and these twists are so ready to come out of my hair so in this video i'm just going to be sharing my top five tips for taking down protective styles so the first tip that i want to share is to remember how the twists were installed and to do the exact opposite to take it down so the last thing i did when I installed my twist into my hair was to pull my braid through the twist using a crochet hook. So now I'm just going to do the exact opposite of that and I'm going to try to get my braid out of the twist. At this point, I can totally cut the braiding here, but I wanted to use it for something else. And so I took my time to get the braiding here out without cutting it. So the next tip I have for you guys is to ensure that your hands are lubricated when you begin touching your real hair. So I'm just going to apply some oil to my hands and this helps me when I'm touching my hair because your real hair would most likely be very dry at this point. So you want to lubricate your hands so that when you begin touching your hair, you don't break your strands. Get as much shed hair out by finger detangling as possible while your hair is dry because anytime you add moisture to your hair, you're going to cause a lot of matting and the final tip i have for you guys is to detangle again using a brush because you might think that you have gotten out all of the shed hair just with your fingers and the oil but trust me you haven't so at this point i add conditioner to my hair for some slip and i detangle again using a brush and you would see I had a lot of shed strands to get out still so that is why I always ensure to do this step before shampooing and that's it get in the shower and do my normal shampoo condition deep condition process I hope this video was helpful please don't forget to subscribe turn on your notifications and more videos will be coming your way soon bye